Hello. And welcome back to G. Hopefully you like that thing. <laughs> Now we're going to play some Resi 4. God, is this the good controller? Yeah, it's the good controller. It is the good controller. I've just been playing the Xbox One for so long, at the, like the past couple of days. That the 360 controller feels weird. So we're going to be playing Resident Evil 4. I it, guess what? I'm back. It's been a while. Yeah, yeah. Tell you you're back. Uh, we played some... Uh, we played some Sonic. Oh, hold on. I think the computer's... No, nope, you did it. No, okay, I took the, I took the sound out. Trust me. Trust me. Me and Zach figured it out. We took the sound out. We're good. So, uh, we're playing Resident Evil 4. Uh, uh, there's a person we also watch uh, named Yahtzee. And he has a game, Silent Hill 2. I think everyone knows who Yahtzee well, is. Well, just a case. Well, he's, he's zero punctuation. And uh, so he says that he plays... Silent Hill 2, because it reminds him of how good gaming can be. Yep. The, the controls aren't the best, the games aren't the best, the, but he, he just loves it so much. For me, it's this game. Resident Evil 4. <laughs> Resident Evil 4. Oh, God, this game is just so cool. So here's some backstory. 1998. I'll never forget it. It was the year one of those Gersley murders occurred. The oh, they... Mountains. Soon after news, this is Resi 1, that the whole world revealing that the fault of the uh, pharmaceutical enterprise Umbrella. So, you know a bit of the Resident Evil story. Yeah, well, I know Umbrella's evil. Yeah. And that they... Basically, virus broke out in Mountain Community, Raccoon City. This is uh, Resi 2. Leon is the hero of Resident Evil 2. So this is him coming back. Yeah. All, all I know from Resident Evil is that Umbrella has... They make mistakes and they release things and their plan to like cover it up like every single time like they do it like 17 different times every single time their plan is to destroy the world and, and cover it up that way in the not movies the games are they sell bioweapons as black market and then they sell the benefits of it to everyone else that so all their pharmaceuticals that they get from doing the bow research they sell to you and then to like africa they sit like you know and those people they sell the bows and then, uh, so, then uh, the mansion incident occurred, so they're just like, fuck it, we're just going to test it. Six So this is six years later. after I, I, Raccoon City. I read it like like the Spongebob, like, seven years later. You can hear Raven taking a shit in the background. Yeah. We gotta listen. <laughs> so he, he works for the president now. His daughter's, the president's daughter's missing. That guy sitting in the passenger seat? Is that a gun or is that his his knee? That's his that's his knee, I think. Okay, because that's, oh, no. that's how I see it. This the was released seat. for the GameCube and PS2. And re-released for the no, Xbox. No, I'm, I'm, I'm not I'm not questioning the graphics, I was just like because that's how I sit. Me and this man have something in common. His ear looks off. Oh god, yeah. <laughs> it looks like he's dead. Yeah. His ear looks... Actually, I think it is damaged from Resident Evil 2, because these guys' ears are okay. Okay. Yeah. Raven! I can't even remember what these guys are talking about. It's not important. <laughs> no. No, clearly. I I'm going to turn on subtitles. Like we always fucking do. Oh, God, I'm so excited. God. So one of these guys to go to take a piss, right? right before I was to take on my oh, the, the guy I apparently had things in common with. That's the ultimate reason I'm in this world. And I came, okay, so another thing is in Resident Evil 2, there's a woman named Ada Wong. I don't even know what this guy's talking about. I was going to cosplay Ada Wong at one point. I knew nothing about the series, but it looked like a cosplay could pull off. Ada Wong is just a girl who uh, was working for Wesker. Okay. Or I she was working for another company. I don't know who Wesker is. Okay. So in Resident Evil 1, Wesker is the guy who's a part of Stars, and then betrays him because he's actually working for Umbrella, and then betrays Umbrella because he injects himself with the T-virus. Okay. So he's, like, superhuman now. He's more important in Resident Evil 5 than number 4. And in this game, Ada Wong comes back because she's working for Wesker, but she's secretly working for another organization called S, which I believe turns into the BSSA, which fights bioweapons. See, so, I, I heard BS, and I'm like, bullshit? No, the sure. Bio Security Agency of America. The BSAA is a part of the second, of Resident Evil 5. 
Okay. But, uh, th- yeah, some hints were leading up to Resi 5. So this is Resi 4. And uh, so basically all that you need to know is the president's daughter's been kidnapped. It's up to us. Save her. And, and this shitty car. It, <sighs> it looks like a piece of shit that's been molded. It is a piece of shit. I'll go and have a look around. Oh, God. See, the thing is, this is the only port I've ever played that was better on the Wii U than anything else because you can aim with the controller on the Wii U. Okay. If, if any, uh, not, not the Wii U, the Wii. If anybody can find a copy of Resident Evil 4 for the Wii, it is one of the best titles for the Wii. It's so good. I love it. Oh, the cat's grooming my foot. He's going to bite it in a second. All right, so. Leon, I, hope you can I hear fucking me. love Hunt again. Do-do-do-do. Yeah, I know, right? Snake? Ow! Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, somehow I thought you'd be a little older. Instantly hitting on her. There's something out now. The daughter of the president. So try to behave yourself, okay? Whoever this group is, they sure picked the wrong girl to kidnap. I'll try to find some more information on my end as well. Good. Talk to you later. I don't like how, like, there's a weird 3D imposed image over top of them. Alright, so it? that's gun... Okay, so this is knife. Get the crow. Get the crow. So I gotta get used to this control system scheme. But yeah. Get the crow. Okay, so that's shoot. Stop wibbling wobbling your shit everywhere, Leon. That crow did not give a fuck. Oh, that crow did not give a fuck at all. What's it doing with 400 pesetas? Okay, that's reload. You're in Spain, right? They're Pesetas? Yep. That's a cute house. Oh. So this is the inventory. It's my favorite inventory of any game ever. Uh, screen set now. Uh, controller setup. Brightness setting. Well, guess who's getting absolutely no fucking subtitles? All right, so here we go. Kidnap by an unidentified group on way home from your university. Kidnappers more still unknown. There's reliable for the perpetrators an insider. Only handful of people know about this kidnapping. Yada 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 yada. So she's in Europe. We don't know who the insider is, and so yeah, now it's it's up to Leon. Hold on. Uh, Xbox Sixty. Uh, it's on his ball, Xbox. Can I adjust the controllers? Oh God. Inverted aim? No! <laughs> oh, button configuration. Left trigger is aim, right trigger is fire. Left and A is reload. Left button and right trigger is swing, ray and knife. Attack with left button. Map. Okay. There's a whole page on game FAQs on how to enable subtitles on this. Really? Yeah. Change it on the main menu. Oh, fuck Not off. Not in game. Okay, there we go. Oh, there we go. That is so much better. All right, okay, I've already fixed up one problem. All right, so here we go. I think we could play with it. Tara, give me. Uh, excuse me. Is it Sir? your first zombie? Yeah, not really. There aren't zombies. There's no zombies in this game. Uh, infected? Yes. That infected bullshit. This is the game that started it. This is also the game that started quick time events and fucking cutscenes. I was wondering if you might recognize a girl. In I really hope that the audio doesn't pick up on this. Probably. No, no, my uh, the thing isn't going off. Yes, it is. Sorry to have bothered you. Very little. Anyway, um. He's like sorry to have bothered you. I have a um, an interesting bit of trivia here. I used to take a writing class in high school. Uh, Mr. Green, he was fantastic. Whoop. You better kill them. Kill that song, bitch. Fuck you. Anyway, um. No, no, no you gotta watch. Don't fucking look at my. Don't look at the laptop. I'm not. So was... like. Here he comes. You remember those guys? He's got run off the fucking road by this fucking truck. I really want Leon's coat. Okay, so I'm going to continue with my story now. Yeah, well, yeah, don't talk during cutscenes. I have no choice but to neutralize them. 
So, Mr. Green brought up an interesting theory that if you ever wonder what America is afraid of during what period of time, think about what started, or like, you, you can look at their, their zombie movies and check their, um, the origin of the zombie. Yep. You know, at the very beginning, what, what caused zombies? Well, voodoo. Well, America was afraid of black people back in, like, the way, like, 30s, 40s. They kill a lot of people. Oh, gosh, that's okay. Um, and, and then it was nuclear fallout. Well, guess what? They were afraid of a nuclear war with Russia. And now uh, they're not even zombies anymore. They're infected. Well, guess what? America's really fucking afraid of germs. Right, see those people out there? Yep. They're going to attack me. So I do this. Headshots don't kill people instantly in this game either. And... We're going to have to headshot this guy in the next episode. Fucking... The hand, you can upgrade your gun for better handling, because I'm so not used to this. Is that a skeleton on the tree? Probably. Is okay, they're coming in. That is some bullshit! Don't argue with my bullshit. Next episode. Oh! Post oh, Next shit. episode! Pause it! Go fuck! I was supposed to kick that guy in the face! Bye!